Alright, what's going on everyone? So today I'm here to talk about Supreme Wave 13, their collab with Vampirella. I believe that's the name of it, but basically this week is not looking so great. Uh, I'm dropping it. Obviously a lot of people agree with me. Uh, some people disagree with me. I'm cool with it. But basically Vampirella is a most fictional character. Uh, she is a superhero and she is basically from a comic. I can't remember the person that created the comic, but it was a very popular comic and basically Supreme is collabing with them. I think it's a cool idea, but the concept and exactly how it looks is not presented well. I'm definitely not aware of it. But basically I'm going to get into all the collab items for those of you who want to hear my opinions, for those of you who are interested in copying, I'll give you guys SMA retail and all that important stuff, so I'm going to get straight into it, show you the items and all that, and let's get started. And by the way, one extra thing you can do just really quick, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button, that mean a lot. I do a bunch of stuff like this, like Supreme Droplets every week, some Palace I'm getting into tomorrow, which is actually the Droplets that we have coming up for Palace, I'm getting into that. And basically I do all that hypey stuff, so be sure you guys subscribe for that if you guys want informal videos like this, and yeah, that mean a lot, thank you. Okay, so basically I'm looking at right here, you have three colorways, you have a black colorway, a white colorway, and a yellow colorway. There was a picture of it, hopefully you saw those. But basically, the whole theme of it is a comic tee, that's what I'm going to call it. And basically, SMA retail, expect something, uh, you know, probably just normal shirt retail, $44, $48, or possibly something cheaper, because I don't think the quality looks too great, so you could see something between $32 and $42, or $44 and $48. Just get it within that range, you know, think about it, because obviously, I wouldn't cop this week, because I'm not liking the whole idea of it. The theme, very cool. Maybe if it was uh, with some other comic character that we all knew a little bit better. If you guys know this comic, that's cool. I'm not hating on you. I'm saying I do not know this comic. That's why I'm dropping it because I do not know anything about it. And it really wouldn't make any sense to copy if I didn't know much about it. So that's why I decided to just leave it aside. Obviously, there's some other brands I didn't know um, that I copped. And, you know, that was just a little bit of a hypey thing there. But I'm just not really feeling this one. And, you know, I'm going to drop this week. I'm not liking it. But I'm now going to get straight into another item, which I actually have a hoodie. So let's get into that. Okay, so there's a bunch of colorways for the hoodies, so I'm going to get straight into that. Here are all the colors. You have like a darker green, a purple, or orange, a red, a white one, and you have a black one. Now, they're cool colorways. Obviously, that seems like the regular Supreme colorways. But if I had to tell you this, obviously, again, you have the Supreme logo. I don't know how many times they've done this so far. Supreme logo is going down the right sleeve this time instead of the left sleeve. So not much originality there. I'm not liking it. It's just it's getting repetitive. It's getting annoying. It's really losing the meaning it had behind it before. And obviously, the meaning of this collab to me is not that strong i'm gonna drop it the hoodies just don't seem that original in the sense because they just look they're the exact same thing as the shirts and they're just a hoodie and they're really not any better than any other regular supreme hoodie that you could find for a lot cheaper price below this retail price so i'm not really thinking about it. i'm not liking these hoodies at all and you know i just i think their colorways don't really go well with the whole theme of the collab so that's why i'm leaving this week alone obviously if you could see some retail prices just expect like 158 dollars just regular supreme hoodie retail if you don't know what it is it's 158 dollars at $10 for your buying online. Obviously, I would not buy this, but it's up to you guys. You guys have your own personal opinions. If you guys are into comics, that sort of stuff, this would be a cool week for you to have to sort of add your collection if you are collecting comics and stuff like that. But for this week, I'm going to leave it alone. I'm not buying anything from it unless there are some cool accessories. Then we may be talking. Okay, so the next item I'll be getting into is Supreme Vampirella. It's another comic tee. That's what I'm going to call it. I don't have another name. Basically, another collab tee. It's cool. You have two colorways. Hopefully, I'll show you guys a picture right now. You have a black colorway and a white colorway. The shirt sort of looks cool. Obviously, you have Vampirella right there standing in the center. And then you, I think it looks like Dracula to me. Again, Vampirella sort of comes from Vampire. I think it's Dracula actually coming over sort of in the picture in the background right there. And obviously, I like the whole idea of it. But again, some repetitiveness I see. It's another screen printer. And then obviously, right here on the left sleeve, again, you have Supreme right there so again same thing as the hoodie really you just need to stop screen printing the supreme logo on one of the sleeves leave that off for a couple weeks and then eventually put it on again to build some hype for it it's losing hype because they're putting it on so many shirts so many items now and i'm just not liking the whole idea so again i'm dropping this week because i'm not into comics really if you guys didn't know just expect normal shirt retail for this one because this one is just a regular supreme printed shirt that's why i said the other item i think it'd be a bit lower quality that's why i priced it lower i'm not sure but for the other shirts expect 32 42 to 44 to 48 for this one is definitely going to be within the normal shirt retail, which is 44 to 48 dollars. So that's what I'm thinking. I'm not liking the quality again, but basically, I'm going to drop this week, so I'm not into the whole comic idea. For all the people that like comics, it's definitely a cop week for you. That's what I think. It's an okay week. I'm not really liking. It. I think it's the weakest week so far. Um, we Levi was weak, and then this was pretty weak. But again, if Levi sold out in like under 10, uh, under 15 seconds, then I don't know how fast this will sell out. I think this is going to be like Rap a Lot Records going to sit. And it really, it's a week that was extremely slept on. Rap a Lot Records, I regret not copying. But this week, I don't think anyone really will regret not copying other than people that are into comics. 
sorry if I got a bit repetitive there. You know, I just love talking about Supreme and really, I get really into it sometimes. You know, that's why you see my voice raise a bit sometimes and I give you guys a bunch of opinions. Sometimes I go a bit too far, but you know, hopefully it's understandable. Hope you guys were able to hear that, understand it, and really think about whether you want to cop or drop depending on who you are. But anyways, thank you all for watching this video. I mean, a lot of you guys like the video. It's up to you, really. But make sure you guys do subscribe. That's something I'd love. Reply to all comments below. And basically, what subscribing does, I'd like to tell you guys, is it basically updates you on all Supreme stuff, like updates, news, what's dropping each week, what you may want to cop, retail prices, all that important stuff you need to know for Supreme to cop your items. Be sure you guys subscribe to me for that. I give you guys real and legit information. I usually am rarely wrong. Uh, obviously, I've had a couple oops in the past, but I've worked in that. It's been a lot better. But anyways, thank you all for watching this video, and I hope to see you guys as a new subscriber. I'm next video.